print size. So right now, if I go to image, image size, I have roughly 11 by 17 by 240 resolution. The problem is I need to crop out some elements in this photo before I go to print. So this is how it works. What I need to do is first go into the marquee tool and go to 11 IN by 17 IN. I type those in. Then I click in it and I can move it around after the fact. I want to move it into the area where I have the most image I want to keep. In this case, I don't want any of these elements. Now I right click on this and go to transform selection. You must hold shift and you click and drag until you get what you want in the shot. It's very important that you hold shift. Go to the move tool and apply this. So I'm aiming for an 11 by 17 print. I now go to go image crop. Now if you look here under image image size I have a 10 by 15. I'm going to show you how to upscale an image as big as you want probably up to about 40 inches without losing any resolution. What you do is, is resample it using best for enlargement. Also in the pixels you choose percentage. So I'm looking for an 11 by 17 so I'm going to raise it all the way up to about 110 but never go over 110. And the reason for that is it will never resample as much and it will tend to be grainy after a while. So only do it by 110 increments until you reach the print size that you need. In this case I have 11 by 17 but it's 0.3 so I'm going to see what 109 is. And then I'm going to go 108 and then 105 and then 106. So 7 is 11 by 17. So that being over just a little bit will not hurt it. In fact, you'll have some kind of little bit of a bleed going on, which is important also. Okay, so it upscaled it by cubically, and that's what I have. Here's my print variation, which is a little slightly different, not much. You can see a little bit more in the eyes. Okay. All right, now that we have a working print, now we have to talk about where and how to get it print and what you should do there. Okay, and that's in the next video.